Hello everyone. This video is about WooCommerce downloadable products setting. Yeah, downloadable products. Yeah, by default settings, it's okay. Uh, we don't have to change much, but we have to. Uh, we need to understand what's going on inside of this thing, WooCommerce. Yeah, there are two, three options for file download method. First is first download. This is a default WooCommerce method. That uh, another is X Excel redirect X, X send file method and uh, redirect only. This is insecure. That uh, I do not recommend it. Post download or Excel redirect method. Post download is okay, but Excel redirect method is yeah. I think it is good for. Here, let me read this for. Posting downloads will keep URLs hidden, but some servers may serve large files unreliably if supported X and access can be used to system. So it is saying that, yeah, post download is good. It hides the URL, uh, uh, media file URL. Yes, you know, all the files that we have uploaded in the WordPress uh, server, website server, they have its own URL, website link. To the media file so it is hidden with force download but yeah you, you we can redirect it with this x excel redirect x send file method but yeah it is good for last file but it did some settings and server yeah if uh, if you want to use this excel redirect send file then if you do not how to configure your server web hosting and all then you can contact your web hosting company they will solve the problem for you yeah they you can yeah contact the support from your web hosting web hosting provider then they will solve the first problem for you this is for the last files and uh, usually most most of the time 80% of the websites, WooCommerce websites, will not need this file. First download is okay. We uh, mostly we sell about maximum file size may be 100 MB. Yeah. What's the need for the last file? If it is video file, maybe it, if it is maybe last. But are you selling video movies nowadays? Ah, uh, <laughs> I don't think you have the market. <laughs> There are lots of big company Netflix and all for selling, yeah, streaming movies and all. So we cannot grab the market with WooCommerce or our WooCommerce website. So we are selling like ebooks, PDFs, or yeah, templates, themes, plugins, PS, uh, PHP scripts, or any programming scripts, something like that. Those things. It may maximum maybe so those software yeah maybe uh, but um, it will not uh, my point is it will not exit one GB one gigabyte so post download is okay this default setting leave it by default but if the situation demands you want to use this X send file method then contact your Contact the support for your web hosting account, uh, web hosting provider. Access restriction, download required login. Okay. This setting does not apply to guest processes. So, by default, it is unsafe. Because if, even if it is safe, it, it does not matter. Because those who have buy the product with guest processes would not need to, uh, does not need to log in. Yeah. To download it. So, you can force them, when they sell out, you can force them to create an account, WooCommerce account, compulsory the account, so that, yeah, so that you can use this setting. If you use this setting and let them open an account when they check out compulsory, then there is no option for guest, yeah, guest processes. Guest processes is, uh, is the convenience for the customers, but inconvenience for us. Yeah, in the management. So, I think you you can uh, yeah in the account and privacy setting you can uh, uh, uncheck the guest processes and and you can 
check here so that everyone needs to log in to download those downloadable products so yeah guest passages is okay for one time things like buying a book not the ebook but the physical book or cloth a t-shirt maybe it is okay you we will ship them to the customers it's one time thing but downloadable product is not one time thing for example elementor pro we buy elementor pro we sometimes need to log into elementor account and download the latest uh, version of elementor pro so so guest processes for downloadable product is not desirable if you want to sell downloadable products in your woocommerce store you have to uncheck uh, guest processes in the account privacy setting and you can check here to to force them everyone to log into your woocommerce website to download their processes their downloadable products grant access to downloadable products after payment yes this is compulsory yeah if you if they can download the downloadable products even they have the process has not been paid man uh, process payment has been not been done then what's the meaning of selling the downloadable product they can start the initiate the process process and download the product that's a very huge loophole so this setting is i think unnecessary so you blip the default it should be check this file name it's also necessary you you, you live it is by default setting append a unique string to file name for security it is very necessary yeah when you download a product downloadable product from the woocommerce there will be some string on the file name yeah uh, automatically automatically generated string file string name is very important for security otherwise they might guess the file name and download that from your uh, yeah media directory yeah nowadays if uh, I, most of the file directory has been restricted through ice, uh, ice access but yeah when uh yeah i used to design joomla 2.5 uh, yeah i have in, uh, in those times a you know, few years back i have tried pd downloading pdf ebooks from the website or and, uh, downloading the plugins joomla templates and, and the, those things and uh, yeah to be honest i succeed many times <laughs> so a pending file name is a very yeah it's a it's a very good security practice so you have to check this option these things yeah these things except for this one all uh please leave to all those default settings you do not change you do not you do not need to change them but yeah as i have explained before you need to know what's going on here and why are they doing this way so i hope this explanation is be helpful to you maybe my wordings uh, my explanation my action is not understandable to you so please watch the video slowly and if you have any questions please for, don't forget to leave a comment below thanks for watching again please don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel